guys, Kat Ray here. So as you can see, I have this box next to me. This was just delivered to us. And man, I was so impressed with the deliver guy. This guy was a big guy. He just picked up this thing. This has to be hundreds of pounds. Okay, maybe I'm exaggerating. But this is a secret surprise for my husband, Josh. Josh loves to cook. That is one of his greatest hobbies. And tell you the truth, he is really, really good at it. So those of you that don't know what a butcher block is, it's basically one of those tables that's kind of a nice square size that's for cutting up food. And in our kitchen, we have um, these cutting boards that are just fairly small. They're just not the best cutting boards. So this is my project for the day is to build a surprise for Josh. Well, it's kind of a surprise, but he's going to be here to help me make it. So I got the box down. I'm so excited to do, to get this open. So right here on the side, it has a symbol of no box cutters, probably because you don't want to cut the wood of this chopper board. So I got some scissors. I'm going to be very, very gentle with this. Ha ha, there we go. Let's do the other side. Okay, so as you can see, we got the box open and it is all padded with styrofoam. And as you probably know, styrofoam can be so messy if you throw it around. So I'm gonna to try to be as clean as possible. So I brought up this other box. We're just gonna take these pieces and put them right in there. This one's kind of long, so I have to cut it in. This one's kind of long, so I had to cut it in half. Okay, so I was kind of wondering, as you look at a picture, you can't always tell the color of it. So now I get to see the top of it and the color, and it's a very good color. It's kind of light, it's not super dark, but super bright, so and it's really smooth. So let's get this thing unboxed. Okay, well, some of you men or good builders could just pull all these pieces out and put them together, but I need those instructions. So I'm going to be pulling them out, looking for those instructions, and then we'll go from there. shopping one thing I really loved about this butcher block were these baskets I'll have to show you obviously as we put it together but it comes with these two baskets that are kind of slide out underneath the board that you can keep supplies man look at those those are really cute I found the instructions contains required hardware do not discard okay good thing I think it says that. <laughs> You'd throw it away if it didn't say that. <laughs> I'm not saying I would have, but I'm saying where there's a very good chance those could have gone <laughs> yeah, in the garbage. It's a good thing they wrote that for because you. Because <laughs> when I looked at these, honestly, I thought it was one of those padding kind of full of air. I mean, I looked closer and I can tell that it's hardware, but it's a good thing it said that. Oh, and another fun thing about this butcher block that we purchased is it came with some tools. I don't know how much we'll actually use these, but the fun thing is, is they have little strings so you can kind of just have them hanging there, kind of a, as a design thing. But we'll put them in the baskets for now. As you can see, I've laid out all of my parts, gone over these instructions, the first step is to do the basket and that, but we're going to put that aside for now. And I mean, we were pretty clean about the styrofoam, but you can see there's still little pieces all over the place. We definitely got to do some vacuuming after this. So let's build this block. Where are you? You're right where I need to be. Move, buddy. So we 
got the table all set up. Now we just need to flip it over and put those baskets in. It will be all done. Okay, let's flip it, Josh. Flip this way. Okay, so the basket just easily fits inside of this. It just slides in like that. Voila, let's do the other one. Now that we got this butcher block all put together, we're gonna move it to the kitchen. Is it gonna fit? No. Okay, I guess it's not gonna be fitting this side. We're gonna have to go the other way. Well, thanks for watching. We're all done with our project. We got this thing all set up. I'm so excited to see Josh doing his chopping on it and so pleased with how sturdy it is. That's always a worry thing when you order something and you can't actually touch it, is see how sturdy it is. So it's very beautiful. So remember, work hard, play hard. We'll see you on the next project.